I carry a bandana or a handkerchief every day, and there's a good reason for it. In fact, there's about 10, and we're going to show you those. Always take a spare handkerchief when you go to a wedding or a funeral. Somebody might need one, and it's a good thing to be able to share with them. Now, those of us who are becoming more uh, follically impaired, or challenged, or bald, you'd have some way to keep that spot on top of our heads from getting sunburned. We've all seen the pirate bandanas. All you're doing is tying a triangle and tying it behind your head. This one, if you'll notice, has these little coverings for your ears, so the tops of your ears and your ears won't get sunburned. It's very important to have something around your neck. This will shade it from the sun and possibly keep the mosquitoes off. And finally, here's something you want to do, but you don't want to do it with a really black or a really dangerous looking color. Put this over your face like this. Now what I have done is use three bandanas. I'm almost completely covered. My nose, my cheeks, and the rest of my ears will pretty much be sheltered from the sun or whatever's out there. This is a good technique to know and a good reason to take three bandanas with you outdoors. You'll find a lot of uses. You may need it to filter water. Now let's say you've gathered some water in your plastic bag that you take with you everywhere. How are you going to carry it? That's going to get old after carrying it a little ways. Take your bandana, tie the corners, put this in there, then you're going to tie these. You have then created this little water carrier container. Obviously, this kind of container can work for anything you want to carry. Rocks, pine cones, tinder, something like that. If you didn't bring along flagging, you might need to use that brightly colored piece of cloth to mark your trail. Char cloth is a cooked material that will catch sparks. It's easy to make, but you probably need some 100% cotton. This is where you would sacrifice your bandana. During a medical emergency, you may have to improvise. You may need your bandana to make a sling or a bandage. It's a good idea to carry handy wipes or antiseptic wipes, but they can probably only be used once. For wiping your hands when you don't necessarily need to sterilize them, use your bandana. Tie one to your belt while you're hanging out at camp. The different colors can show support for cancer research. Blue is for prostate and thyroid. Black is for melanoma. And my favorite, gray, signifies support for brain cancer research. And finally, the last thing you want to use your bandana for is toilet paper. When number two becomes your number one priority, you want to make sure you're properly equipped. This is survivalcommonsense.com. Thank you for watching, and don't forget your bandana.